you guys last week um, I am going to be doing a video on what you should take to school with you. So basically, right, so this is basically what I'm going to be taking to school with me. Uh, except for this bag over here, I am, like I said before, I'm a big electronic nut, so that's all my electronics. You don't need, you don't need to, um, you don't need to take all that stuff with you, but I'm making YouTube videos, so I'll go over that stuff I'm taking with me too. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm taking probably one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pairs of pants. I'm going to probably be taking, a, um, this is just all pants, so I'm probably going to get another uh, couple pairs of shorts because you don't know where you're going to be at. Uh, one day you could be in Minnesota and it's 26 degrees. The next day you could be in California where it's 97 degrees or Texas where it's 97 degrees. So you're going to be able to change on that. Uh, as far as my shirt, I have a bunch of t-shirts and then I got some Under Armour as well just to Just in case I'm somewhere cold and I run out of long sleeve shirt. I have pullover jackets um, I got a rain jacket that I'm gonna take it with me and then I'm probably gonna take a car hard Take my car hard with me uh, for a severe winter jacket in this case it gets really really cold So but you're gonna want to kind of minimize if you take too much clothes one Part of it might be a good thing because you won't have to do a laundry. Two, it's more stuff you're going to take with you. So I, I'm going to try to minimize the amount of clothes I take with me and just, you know, every three or four days do do laundry. So now what I got here, I got a bag. I have some small things in here, hauls, some more of my hair thingies, um, a lot. You guys that... Um, that go to England, uh, one of the things they say to bring is a padlock. So, like I said, when you when you go to England, they say to bring a padlock with you. Not necessary. I brought, I took one with me, and they and uh, I didn't didn't use it at all, so I just have it. Um, some snacks, I like Swedish fish, uh, Twizzlers. So basically, I just use this part up here for my snacks, the phone holder, and then when you complete, like they gave me a. CR England a little flashlight so that's what's in here so I'm gonna basically use this one for all my clothes so I'm gonna try to put as many of my clothes in here as possible I'm not gonna make you watch me do that so I'm gonna put all my clothes in here pan back all right I have two book bags that I take with me this one, uh, once it's empty, one holds all my electronical stuff, um, all my wires, my chargers, and whatever. And then I also use this for dirty clothes. So when the clothes get dirty, I put them in here. Then I can just take this one thing to get my clothes dirty. My other one, this is my shower book bag. And my shower book bag contains everything I need so when I go take a shower. So I go take a shower, I take this with me, has everything I need in it. Has, I have aspirin extra deodorant, uh, some hair ties for my hair, and extra razors. Oh, and I also keep a charger here because I take a speaker with me. I have, I have a speaker I take with me so I keep an extra, um, well I also use this for the TV in the truck for, as like my sound little miniature sound bar. But, um, so I keep an extra charger and plug in here for that. I also, I'm not sure what all, all I have in here. And then you, you want to leave some empty spots so you have room for a towel. So I keep my second one right where it's where I keep my towels so when it's dry, wet, change of clothes. And then you're also going to want to keep a more, so you're going to need extra room for a towel and you're going to need extra room for your change of clothes and also your dirty clothes. My, uh, sure. Well, in my case, I have extra soap, lotion. Do not buy the cheap lotion because I bought the cheap lotion and five minutes later I was, I was ashy again. So then I also keep a bag in here. When you are on a truck, these are invaluable because you will want to get these everywhere you go because it's going to be, these are going to be your trash bags when you're done. So you got to take trash out and stuff like that. So that's what's in there. Um, and what actually what's cool is I bought this, I want to say in California, bought this book bag at Walmart. And then I was in Arizona or something like that. And um, they had this 
which holds um, you know all my toiletries, my shaving cream, ear wax cleaning yaddy thingies. Um, oh, miniature clippers. Uh huh. That's what I use these because before I was just trying to use a razor, trying to. No, but I bought those as battery operated, so that's good. But anyway, so I bought this in another state, and they matched, and I thought it was cool. And another cool thing you're going to want to look for is this little hook. Because in the showers, and I am a big fan of the Love showers, because in the Love showers, they have hooks. So you can hang this on here and just go and grab anything you need. So just a quick recap here. You're going to need to take your toilet toiletries. If you want to take a lot of clothes, you're not going to have to do laundry that often. But that's more room and, and stuff you gotta take. I take try to take a min, minimal amount of clothes, so you're gonna need cold, cold uh, warm clothes, and then uh, shorts and stuff. So when you depending on you know if you're over the road, you could be in, like I said in California one day and Missouri the next. Um, I take two book bags. This one carry holds all my electronics, and also is when my when I get uh, dirty clothes and I just basically put my dirty clothes in here. So if I'm going to go wash and just take this with me um, I also take a laptop just for editing purposes um, these are actually really cool to get uh, and get them before you go because they're, everything is expensive in the, in the truck stops everything so this might be 98 cents at Walmart and in the truck stop it'll be 2.98 or two dollars for this so shop at Walmart whenever possible so what I need you guys to do now, very important, uh, I believe it's over here, there's a like button. Hit like, subscribe, pay attention to all the crazy stuff I have to talk about. Um, I'm also going to start doing um, product reviews of things because, I, like I said, I like things that are, um, that are plug in. And my next video I'm going to be putting up, I'm doing a uh, review of the Mini Max. This is a, the... Uh, it's a jumper, the little miniature jumper that you keep in your glove box. So I'm going to be doing a review on this in my next video. So that's it for now. Like and subscribe. Like, like button. Down. Go ahead. I'll wait. Hit the like button. Okay, still waiting. Hit, hit the like button. It's real easy. I mean, no one's watching, so just hit the like button and subscribe. All right, that's it. Like and subscribe. See you guys in the next video.